Chapter 2, Lesson 4, Alien Encounter is a two-part assignment. Part 1, we would do a stepwise refinement and in part 2, we would create our animation analysis. So this is Chapter 2, Lesson 4, Part 1, Alien Encounter, Stepwise Refinement. Open the notes document for this lesson and answer the questions as you go through this video lecture. Learning Target I can do a stepwise refinement on Alien Encounter animation. We're going to follow the four-step process in solving our alien encounter animation. The first step is understand the problem. The alien robot is walking to the alien and poking the alien. Alien gets annoyed. Alien says go away to the alien robot and starts walking towards the maze to go away from the alien robot. Create walking methods for alien to walk forward. Also create turn left and turn right methods. You will use walk forward turn left and turn right few times in correct sequence. So in my first method, place these methods in an order that will guide the alien successfully, get away from alien robot and go through the maze to find his spaceship and then take off. When we talk about understanding the problem, we need to identify the objects, the characters or the props needed for the animation. And the second step we need to do is identify the actions. Now let's watch the alien encounter animation. Let's watch this alien encounter animation again. This is the alien robot. He's poking the alien. Alien is getting annoyed. And the alien is walking forward. The alien robot is chasing the alien. The alien is saying go away. Then he walks forward a few times and then turns right and then turns left and then walks forward. The end is not given to you in here. You have to create an end. The end of the story for this alien encounter animation could be your choice. Now you could make the alien go to the spaceship and then take off. Step 1. Understand the problem. Let's go over your notes. And the first thing you need to do is understand the problem. Now write one or two sentences that describe what this program will do. So pause your video and write a short summary. Now here is my answer for step 1, understand the problem. I have written a couple of statements to describe what the animation is about. The alien robot is annoying the alien and the alien tells him to go away. The alien walks through the maze to his spaceship and then takes off. Now you will identify the objects, the characters or the props needed in the animation. What characters and props are needed. Write in step 1 the objects and props that you have seen in the animation. Next, identify the actions. What are they doing? Like the alien robot is poking the alien and the alien is walking forward, alien is turning left, alien is turning right, or alien is saying something. Now identify the objects that you would use. I've written alien robot, alien, spaceship, there are boulders, they're called as plateau. What actions are performed? Turn left, turn right, walk forward, poke, etc. Step 2 Design When we talk about designing a solution, we set up the scene. Now this scene is already given to you, so you don't have to create the scene. The second step you want to do is develop a storyboard. That means write an algorithm. Step 2 Design Procedures In order for us to write a storyboard, we will uh, write algorithm for procedures. That means we would do a stepwise refinement. As you all know, stepwise refinement is a process for breaking a problem into larger tasks and then breaking each task into simpler steps. So in this problem in here, I have given you the larger task. Alien annoyed, walk forward, turn right, turn left, take off. So these are the five larger tasks. Now for each of these tasks, you have to break it down further into simpler step. Now we would write simple steps for alien annoyed. Uh, we would write simpler steps for walk forward. We would write simple steps for turn right. 
we would write simple steps for turn left and then we would write simple steps to take off. Step 2. Design stepwise refinement. Now watch the animation and write the actions happening for each procedure. Now let's go back to our notes and let's start writing our actions that's happening for each procedure. Alien annoyed, walk forward, turn right, turn left and take off. As we are going to watch our video, we are going to do a stepwise refinement and we are going to complete a storyboard. I've already told you the five tasks that we're going to create for this animation. The first one is alien is getting annoyed. So I'm going to copy this and put my heading over here. Now for alien annoyed, now I'm going to watch my video and I'm going to write my instructions for here. So I'm going to say alien robot is going towards the alien. and alien robot is poking the alien so I'm going to keep writing my instructions here so pause the video and you write your instructions for your procedure so this is what my first procedure looks like alien annoyed and I'm going to change the color of that to red so that I know this is my procedure name and my instructions goes in here. And you don't have to write your instructions in very detailed step by step. We'll do that when we write a code. So right now just give an outline what is happening in Alien Annoyed. So I'm writing Alien Robot is moving to the alien. He's poking the alien. Alien is turning left and walks forward. Alien Robot follows the alien at the same time. And uh, Alien says go away and then he turns to face the plateau. As by my instructions, my second procedure is walk forward. I'm going to put my title name in here, walking forward. And then you want to write instructions for walk forward. Now keep one thing in mind, write instructions for the action that needs to be happening. So our procedure name says walking forward. So just write walk forward. So in here I'm going to write alien moves forward. And I'm just going to put one meter. So continue writing your step-by-step -step actions for each procedure. I will keep writing mine. So pause the video and I will finish my step-by-step refinement on the procedures and you will finish your procedures. Now once you're done with your step-by-step uh, -step refinement for step two, you have five procedures, alien and not, instructions for it, walking forward, instruction for it, Turn right instruction for it, turn left instruction for it, and take off instructions for it. Now what we need to do in our next step is we need to write our textual storyboard using these procedures. We are going to watch this animation and we are going to use these procedures and create our story in here. So the first thing that's happening in here is alien a robot is annoying the alien. So we have written all the instructions but we are not going to write in detail what's happening. So we are just going to say alien annoyed and we are going to copy and paste this in here. That's alien annoyed. Now after alien is annoyed, this is all alien annoyed instructions. It says go away. Now alien will walk forward. One step, two step, three step. So I'm going to call walk forward and I'm going to call walk forward here. I'm going to write three times. So I'm going to use my count procedure. Now alien is going to turn right. So we're going to say turn right. And then he's walking forward again. One, two. So he's walking forward two times. And then he's turning left and walking forward. So he's turning left and again he's walking forward. Now the last procedure is takeoff. So you could have alien robot go to the spaceship and goes inside the spaceship and then takes off. 
so I can just write takeoff procedure in here so in my first method you should just call the procedures in order for you to complete the story now once you're done writing your stepwise refinement then the last step would be actually go to Alice and start creating procedures and then call the procedures to test it